Hello and welcome back to City Bus Manager. And from where we left it over the last episode, we have just pushed through the night. I've assigned the morning buses so we can see him heading off to go make us some money. And what has also happened since then is oil has arrived so we can start repairing these vehicles that need oil. Get their quick oil replacement in and you can do the rest of your shenanigans and stuff and and we should have everything then being very, very nice. Yeah. You somehow managed to avoid the clean. I think they avoided the clean because they came in late. Last night they were on the, the late night shift. Anyway, that has those buses all being fixed up, repaired, clean, washed, ready to go. So what I will do while we start the day off is I'll talk about adding in other routes going this way. One over here to the university and then one up into the housing over here. I think this university one might wait a little bit. We probably don't need to um, put one into this area here basically along the same route. Uh, this isn't always the busiest route. But I will run one out this way. So I will do that very quickly. Build my own new route typically starting in that same place, running out through Picton Arcade, Kingsway, Queen's Marketing House, and then along this, whoop, I've done that wrong, haven't I? We will delete that one, we will delete that one. There we go, that's more like, we don't want to be stopping in the middle of nowhere, that would just be useless. Then the Uplands Hotel, and then instead of following this way into this second area, and up, but it's a different thought now. We're actually going to run it up this way through Victoria Street and Glamour PO and so on and so forth. And then I need to think about which way I want this to go. Oh, yeah. Maybe I'll run another route up here. I think this is another hospital here. This is Clenfee Hospital. Or do I run into the hospital now? I don't want to come for this shopping district here. Hmm. No, we'll go, we'll go to the hospital. We are changing plans wildly, it sometimes seems like. No, 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 no. Once again, I'm changing my mind again. We will bring in a route across this way into that hospital. This one will just carry on this way. Sorry, I will make my mind up and stick to it one day. But today is not that day. And then we're going to run it up into the housing over this way. And we will do a loop up over here. One stop there. Stop there. Oh, no, no, no. We don't want to do that. Is that going to work? Yeah, there we go. Then we do a quick loop. We've got three without names over here. Maybe we'll use one of these as our timing point if I can remember. But as we all know, I don't remember them very well. So we will just do whatever seems to work. Otherwise, we are just going to just track this route all the way back to the um, back to the bus station where we started it off from. And there we go. SW404 is a go. So we will add some timing points onto there, but first, the usual, we will do till 10 30. Every half an hour. Actually, no, I'm going to change this because it's basically doing the same as a three. So we'll do these 15 minutes later. Uh, so it's going to be a shorter time servicing, servicing this one, but they will survive. And then we will do advanced settings. And then again, the usual where we do it Monday to Saturday. 
and then we want to have down here what was it uplands hotel we'll add two minutes in there it wasn't glamour um oh we'll do the college should we do the college no number three here we'll do three minutes waiting there and then it was back to uplands hotel one minute waiting there happy days copy this is such a nice um, new feature having the copy and paste down here it saves me so much time having to scroll through and in the future when we start having longer bus services that's just going to be so so ideal so we'll do these 20 minutes later on a Sunday just because I can to 9.20 there we go and we will confirm on that one so that'll have another route going up over that way. One thing I did realise the last time, and I've just remembered now, is Route 3 here is meant to be um, SW03 for Swansea Route 3. Tick. Confirm. All confirmed. No other changes, so nothing really matters there. And then what I was also doing is that I was practising, uh, well, practicing, I was considering where to put routes in earlier, and all of these stops here I was popping in. And I'm now paying three euros twenty a day to have these stops here, which aren't being used, will not well, and won't be used for a while because they were just me trying to work out where roads go. So one thing I do find confusing with this game sometimes is um, it's difficult knowing which roads are one way and so. It's like I don't know Swansea, I don't know um what the roads are like. But I think along here, there's a run, there's a one-way road, not a one, one runway. It doesn't matter. But I, can't, but it's really hard to tell. And with some of these junctions, or you can't, you can't get a turn a certain way. Like if you know the place in real life, it works. It's fine. It's good. But I don't know. And talking about that, what I have also realised is I've not given you a Swansea fun fact. There, yeah. Um, I will get onto it in just a moment. That probably requires me to Google one because I don't know. I haven't got one lined up yet for today. Um, cool. Swansea fun fact. Let's Google that. Okay, Google. Swansea fun facts. Here we go. We're doing it in real life. Cool, yeah, you had Google try. I'm the one who talks here, Google, not you. Um, cool. The land area is approximately 379.7 square kilometres. Ooh, who knew that? But an even funner fact, approximately 69%, the best number I'm sure we'll, uh, the best number I'm sure, the, the best number I'm sure we'll all agree, is rural leaving only about 30% of it to be urban. Hmm. There we go. Which gives a, a, a population density, as we remember from the first episode or the last episode, where I really told you the population, of 630 people per square kilometre. Does that count as a fun fact? I don't know. Let me know. Or don't let me know. But there we go. Fun facts all around. Boom. Anyway, time for another new route, as I think we have enough spare buses for another little one and what I'm going to do is just run it down here into the harbour. I don't think it's going to pick up very much it's not even going to be a very long service to run so we'll just do that and you need to pop in a new stop here on the opposite side of the road because this is one, one way and I understand that that is one way and we're going to just stop over here at the Swansea Civic Centre and then we're just going to just trundle in to here. We put quite a few stops in. I imagine this being quite a nice area just along the waterfront. People coming in, I imagine there's a few sort of restaurants and pubs and like converted warehouses or people coming down to the marina for boats. Maybe coming down to like, I mean I imagine there's a beach down the front here. Lots of good things going on but that's just me imagining it because as it's probably painfully aware to anyone from Swansea. I do not know Swansea. 
But anyway, we'll stop down here at West Pier, Delhi, and Coffee Shop, and then we will just run it all the way back in. And I wonder, will you? Yeah, it looks like I can pop it in there. That works absolutely fine, better than expected. And then back to finish it off, and you will be SW05. Easy peasy, lemony squeezy. So we'll tick that one, and as you've guessed it, we'll run it till 10 o'clock. We won't do to 10.30. After all, it's probably not that busy. Yes, we've got 10 to 25 people in there, so it's not going to be a busy bus is needed for the current timetable every how about every, every 20 minutes oh we're back down to one let's do the advanced settings so how long is this taking us 17 minutes west pier we'll do one minute waiting there we'll come back and then happy days and we'll copy that and then stand it again we'll do a new timetable for sunday and we'll paste and that will be just every half an hour until 8 o'clock. And we'll start it at 6. So we'll do a 6 to 9. So they've still got plenty of services going. Confirm. Yes, that should all be good. So we've got two new routes. The other thing that we did is we managed to get past our 25 trophies here. So this gives us access to one of our public service lines to Ficton. Is it Ficton or is it Picton? Ficton, I think. So Ficton, is, I think, is over here. And it's a bar, I think. You've got the Ficton and you've got Bunker. Or Bunkers, you've got Smoker. And what do you want? What, what, what do they want? Connect 336 buildings. Uh, connect at least one train station. Friday to Saturday. Uh, 9.54 to 2.54 every 60 minutes. Okay, so it's like a late night one for people getting back to the train station. I think after having a night out. So we'll start over here at Swansea Sainsbury and then we'll just come back up that way. Or maybe we won't. We won't do it. We'll, we'll come through here with a couple of stops. Swansea Leisure Centre, St Mary's Church, there we go, we already have our buildings well and truly covered. All we need now is a train station. So I will just come up here to High Street. Now if we push shift, as it says here, we can do a waypoint. So I can do that, so we do a loop around here. It just makes it feel nicer that we're not, um... That we're, yeah, that it's not just sort of you turning it in the road, we're just giving it a loop and we thought about it. So we'll stop it there. And then we'll come back round and we'll finish that loop off. And this will just be called Ficton 06, I think it is. Uh, yes, we've got one. Oh, sorry. I was pointing my finger, that's not going to work for you. So I've got the first one one, two, three, four, five, yes, six. I'll put it in brackets because it's less important. There we go. Tickety, tickety. Now, there's not much that I can change here. We're not going to get many people on this service. Advanced, but we get paid a little bit for it. So we're going to put this up here. We're like basically 15 minutes waiting. And it'll come back down over here. So we're waiting basically half an hour over here. Waiting 15 up here. Easy peasy. Not much I want to do about that. Confirm. Happy days. So there we go. We have a whole bunch of new routes assigned. Let's see what people are saying. There is no Wi-Fi on the buses, which is disappointing. It is important for us travellers to stay connected during the long journeys. I don't do long journeys though. Like we're literally looking at like a 15-minute journey on a bus. Surely you have data on your phone if that is really important. You need to sort your life out, Zendek. Um, you are a dirty youth. Get off your phone and look out the window. Yeah, I was live Klein. I don't know what your issue is, but let's look at you. you got some scruffy hair and a dodgy moustache going on. Yeah, I don't trust you. You were probably very happy, but you just want to do poo-poo all over us. Christopher Meyer, we like you. You're welcome back on our service. Anyway, enough looking at that. Maybe if we do get the Wi-Fi on the buses, that will push up our rating. 
And then what do we have here? Stan of Love. It is fun to work here. Thank you very much. Relaxing job. I can imagine working here for a long time. Good, that's nice to know. But let's speed things up and get our buses back out on the road. So Swansea 04. This will be hopefully on... Oh, not operational. So we'll just speed things up. We'll get that bus fixed and we'll get him out there. And then I'm going to go by another couple of these L LFSs while I'm waiting. Do we have one of these for zero 05? Yes, we do. Zero 04, not operational. Let's keep things moving. Okay, I need three buses on that that we're going to have to pause. Bus fleet, not bus fleet. Marketplace, how much does a, does a new LFS cost me? 21, we don't want to buy a new one. We want some second handies. Oh yeah, we did the unlock. So at the end of the last episode, I put on research for buses and I got that one, un that model unlocked. Let's offer you 1450. Ew, oh good, you've accepted that one. Um, nice. We've got 18 grand. Oh, we've got another one here. Will you take 1660? Yes, you will. That is very nice. Now let's speed things up, get those buses in. Now I know some of these LFSs are just getting cleaned and washed, so they should be fine in just a moment. Cool, get, 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 get it on you. There you, go. you take that one. Pause. Ah, what have I done? Oh, I pushed X, didn't I? I always do that. What do you need to get? Indicator and tyres. Let's get those fixed. What do you need? You need an engine. You probably need that to run your service and a V-belt. We'll do as quick as we can to get the basics done. I think you'll probably need some fuel too. And you can take that one. And hopefully in just a second, I should do have a bus up here. We'll put you on there for now. And then we'll replace you back with an LFS in just a moment. So actually all things considered, I thought we were going to have more spare buses in here. But having put those new services in, we um, actually have nearly all our buses out. We just have the one Citro lying around here, which is basically for like an emergency backup bus at this point. Um, maybe I'll use it for the um, Ficton route, as it only looked like it had like 5 to 10 people on it. And being black, it looks like a nice night bus, that one. Uh, we will fuel, we will clean, we will wash you. We've got all the buses out. So actually, we've got these two spare ones here. One of them which will be used to replace that. Um, new Ramesses on that route. If we get some research going. Let's, we are actually going to research now air conditioning. Um, it would probably be quite useful to have our buses nice and cool. Particularly at the moment in the UK, we are going through a balmy, scorching period of time. Like it's not rained for like three weeks. It's been baking, baking hot. Which is probably going to date this video quite badly, actually, because I imagine soon this weather is going to break and we are going to have thunderstorms and all the rest of it. But until then, I'm just going to keep saying we are having mad weather. Mad, mad weather. Also, while, while we're at it, we will then do a passenger information system. Anything else that we can research. Uh, better food for your employees. Well, that is free, so we will do that one. You can have a look at that. Company rating details. We will research that. And shift scheduling. That is what I need to work towards because I really, really want to start organising my buses before it starts getting out of hand. Um, premises, we don't need to do. I am already filling up our area quite quickly. But actually... You don't need any trophies for this, you just need 15 grand. And our money is kicking up fairly quickly and fairly reliably. So we've got, going up, yeah, we've got 7,800, 7,900, 8,000. That's a good rate of climb. Oh, it's just dropped back to 8,000. We're covering 60% of the city. So we are, we are developing fairly well. What we need to do is work out how to get a few more trophies so I can get another solo bus. I would quite like to see what's going on there. Anyway, we've got three new buses. Mechanic, Matthew Kanzai, 
this is Matthew Kanthari, Mechanic. I'm happy to say that we are currently having a lot of fun at work here. I hope it remains to be such a positive attitude. If my payroll doesn't change, I'm out. Um, I'm sorry, Maxine, but what you oh, when you're getting paid 11.80 an hour. How friendly! You're not very friendly. If you leave, it's not a big deal. I am happy to take that risk. Xavier Morris, bus driver. Hey, boss. Friends, uh, through friends, I've noticed that other bus companies pay much better. I would like to see Sally with Justin. Okay. Oh well, unfortunately, Xavier. You were asking for a lot of money. Come what you were asking to start off with. Thirteen fifty seems fine. Seems fine. I'm paying Maxine only eleven something. You're only a trainee at this point. I'll give you ten cent more an hour. There we go. That should get you happier. Now while we're at it, we need to assign some new buses. Assign it. Assign buses to these routes. So LFS on you. A route 5 is the one along the waterfront, so you can take that one, and a zero one, you can take that one. And one second while I cough. Okay, microphone back on. Coughing, hopefully, completed. Oh, a zero two. I don't think we have another new Ramesses. I'll quickly see if I can buy one. Um, if not, you'll take the Citero out. We have 15 grand. Buses will be very useful. You are relatively cheap. Will you take 8,600 for your bus? No, you won't. How about you? Will you take 9,700 for your bus? Okay, nice. Yes, you will. Uh, let's just let's punt. Will you take 7,100? No, you won't. It was a cheeky offer. I do apologise. Right, let's get you fixed and repaired. V belts. We'll do V belts and brake pads because they're nearly gone. And tyres. Safety con safety first, I suppose. And we'll clean and then you'll be ready to go out. You have a route assigned. But the 03 will go onto you. Oh, I think you're having. Oh, you got a flat tyre. Start a repair. We'll put you on on this area for now. Hopefully that will be fine. You better get cleaner to, into you. SW03 onto you. 04 onto you. You've got nothing assigned. We'll assign you to that one and get a cleaner out to you. Bus number two onto you. Oh no, onto you then. Happy days. I'll paint you. No, maybe I won't paint you. You've got other, other stuff happening, I see. Oh, by the look of it, it's filling up in here. Maybe what we need to do is we need to fill out in here. That'd be a nice Friday job. So let's hire two more staff members for in here. Service centre is employees. Yeah, they're both looking pretty stressed. Uh, Dave's, you're friendly, hired, get to work quick. Freddy, you're not very good, but you're friendly. Welcome to the team. Let's get you both out there operating. And then we'll just get a service centre. We need some deskies. It always makes, makes me feel funny when I get our, uh, I get the customers behind the desk. I feel like that's not the place where they should be. Oh, I better move that one in a moment. But first, we'll turn around and we'll just do a rundown. Run down over here. Yeah, look, you're probably quite right to be upset about your wait time. There's not many seats for all of those people, and we seem to have lots and lots of you. There we go. With a little gap for people to get through up there. I'm going to just pop in. Is it a, a lamp or a bin or a, we'll put a bin in there. Probably quite a useful thing to have. Cool. 
not reachable. Oh no, it's because I'm holding onto the bin. It's not because it is unreachable. And then we'll do big do plant pots. Three. Uh, then we'll do two. One. Two. Three. Then we'll do a table. Three, two, one. No, wrong pot, David. Wrong pot plant. It is important that the um that the pattern continues. There we go. And then we need some chairs. I think we've done the black ones up to now. There we go. And then a run of chairs down the other side. Oh, I'll sign that in a moment. There we go. I did a much nicer service at centre now. It is filled up and I feel like we have some future that has some future um It should last me for a while, like some good future proven. We'll get a few more of these, maybe two more. I'll take you. You're too expensive, Perry, and you're not very skilled and friendly. You're cheaper. But we'll take you, because you're... Elena, you're the cheapest. So six of you. Bus drivers, um, you're too expensive. You're pretty expensive. I'm looking for relatively friendly, relatively cheap. You've charmed me in an interview, so there we go. Two more. And we better assign a bus. Um, what was I going to use? I was going to go for the Cetero. But he appears to be out, so we'll put you on there. Happy days. And that has a whole bunch of my, um, and it is looking quite good now. I think, uh, that has a whole bunch of, um, new routes going. Let's see how they're, let's see how they're going. Let's see how much money they're making. So, of course, that's making us lots of money. Swansea, you're running a bit late. That's probably because I was delayed getting buses assigned. So these were fairly even money, but 03, which is the one going slightly more north, and that's the one to the hospital. These two are now diverging. This is making us a lot of money, which is good. How busy are the buses? Nothing too busy. We're not getting any reds on there. Same with you, are we getting any red? Oh, we've got a couple of red ones there. At about the one o'clock time. Zero four. Couple, but I think they're getting close up running late. Zero five. Yeah, that's just all very quiet in there. I don't think this one's gonna make us a huge amount of money, but it does what it needs to do. So I need to improve my company rating so 2.6, and you only need 0.1 of a star more, and it gets us eight more crowns, which would be very nice. I'm very satisfied with the service center. Cool, that is nice. I, I appreciate it having just put the effort into making it. Like it wasn't much effort. Like it's a lot bigger, but it's still not great. There we go. What's being said here? Matty Wawoski, a bus driver or multi would would. Widwowski. I apologise if I'm insulting anyone with, with my name pronunciation, but I'm a bit of a struggle with that. Hey boss, nice thing that was all seem to be going very, very well at the moment. That is very nice, thank you very much. I think this office here needs a bit more improving. It's a bit it's a bit bland and I'll be a bit upset if I if I worked here and that was what, what they'd offered me. So I think these were brown chairs. No, it must have been must have been black. We'll do put one in there and put a table in the corner. Another table up over here. I'll put in a whole bunch of chairs. Gives them some more places to sit down. Some more reading material. I'll put a notice board up in the middle if I get it on the wall. I've got like a, a board for the like union members to put stuff on. Not that I want my drivers to unionize or anything, because that would be a pain. But 
we don't want to tell them that. Have some nice reading material. And then what else do you want in here? We'll put a lamp. It's a bit dark in here. Put a lamp in the corner there. You got a lamp over here. You got a lamp there. Okay. We've got a bit of light going on in there. We'll put another conference table in. I imagine it's sort of been like a bit of a dining table going on. And then some chairs up over this side. There we go. And I'll just put some tables on in, in between. And then we'll put a shelf over each table. We'll take that picture of the wall. I don't know why we have a portrait up there. Um, maybe it's employee of the of the time. Anyway, let's assign these shifts very quickly. So we've got a one, we have a five, we have a two, we have a three, which will be over here. We have a four. We have a one. We have a two. We have a three. We have a four. I'm going to send these buses in to get painted quickly before they go out, maybe. Nope, maybe I can't. Paint that bus. So, while we're at it, clean, wash. I should have done this to all my buses when they came in yesterday. I have already created another template for you. So DC01, and we'll just apply, and we'll send you to get painted. And while I'm here, I'll just get as many of these cleaned, washed, and fueled up before they go out. And I should have done that last night, but instead we were filling out our depot. But it's time now, and we always like watching a quick bit of clean wash fuel. There we go. You're good, we'll leave you for now. So how did our service route go, Ficton? It only made us a little bit of money, but not too bad. How many people were we getting on it though? They all remained pretty quiet through the night. Do we have, no we haven't got a message yet about it. Cool beans. Well you might as well go get painted. You will just leave you as you are. Happy days. What I'm quite looking forward to do now is seeing how our um, service centre handles all these new people during the morning rush. But while we're waiting for that to open up, let's see how all of our buses are doing on our current morning service. So coming down over this way, no one's looking too busy at this point, but it is only 6.50 in the morning. Maybe things will start picking up. Now usually it is the route going this way, the one which is fairly busy, but that's not too bad at the moment. You're fairly quiet. These ones aren't too full. No, it's looking good. Like we have a nice, we have a nice level of service at the moment. People should be getting seats. People should be getting happy. And hopefully that means we should be getting another point one star. What are people saying? The ride, of, the ride comfort was terrible. Worst bus I have ever ever had. Ah, oh, Florian, what was wrong? Tell me more. Oh, you want you wanted Wi-Fi on this bus? Sorry, we're fresh out. Maybe try a horse and buggy instead. Nikolai, sort your life out. Come on, it's not that. <laughs> Maybe we'll give you a horse and buggy. Terrible people. This makes makes me less want to give you your um your Wi-Fi and stuff. But let's see, we'll upgrade. What can we upgrade you with? Um, premium seats? No, I mean we can't do that. That's all locked. Wi-Fi isn't operational. Why can't, do I not have the parts? Oh, that's right. I was trying to click on the circles, but you got to click on the box. Interesting. Well, upgrade all buses. 
Ooh, that cost me a lot of money, but we'll go for it. Bosses will be upgraded one by one by mechanics. Cool. And our service centre seems to be handling everyone really well. Look at that. No one is queuing, no one is waiting. It's 9.30. Watch people buying weekly tickets, complaining about driving style. Look, they're getting better, don't worry. Uh, complaining about friendliness of bus drivers. Yeah, sorry, some of them aren't very friendly, but then... Well, they are... They are bus drivers. What do you expect? Hmm, I'll replace your tyres while we're at it. Now, I suppose what we also need to be doing is buying some more spare parts. We have... Oh, what's that inbox? So, uh, bus driver Ivana, compared to the past, I'm actually really satisfied here. Fictin. Dear Sarah Bannon, we have noticed that it is hardly used. Would you do us a favour and optimise the the route line? Yours sincerely. No, it's I'm leaving it how it is. Like you asked me to do, I've got everything that you wanted. It doesn't matter that it's not being well used. That's not my problem. Just pay me anyway. You wanted it to connect there to a train station. That is what I am doing. Um. Cool. What was I looking up? I was going to do something before I spotted that. Oh yes, I needed I needed some replacement parts, didn't I? So I want to have at least five of everything. Four engines, because that's a lot to have on storage. Five, five. That will be a five. That will also make it five. And that will also make it five. Just deliver it to me when, as and when you have the chance. I keep tapping X. I don't mean to. And there we go. Have you been upgraded? Yes, you have. Ooh, we have another. And we can sign you there. Happy days. Now, hopefully, upgrading those buses will now get me another little start in. Uh, I recently moved to the area and really happy with the bus company Dave Coach. Unlike the buses from the old city, there are not daily breakdowns here. Well, we are a new company. We are trying hard at this point. But we'll wait and see how things go. So, I would quite like some more buses to get back in. Maybe we need a couple more of each go buy a few more but that's probably what we're going to have to do in the next episode but this one is already going fairly long we've had a fairly successful episode we have um, upgraded an awful lot we have a nice big service center set up we have a few new routes we picked up a public service line and our buses are all looking very nice which is very nice but until then i think this is where, we, where we're going to be leaving it so it's goodbye for now enjoy the rest of your day or enjoy your evening or whenever that is and i'll see you again for the next episode when we will have more fun and exciting stuff going on in swansea until then ciao for now <laughs>